<laughs> okay, all right. And then, and this is part B right here. Yeah. And then, can you put that other thing you did? When we were, you already taught them this. We ain't reteaching this. Put that all together. Now, this is a little busy, so they want to do this all at once. But just show them all of them at once real quick. Okay, yeah, that'll work, that'll work. So, we got part A covered, we got part B covered, we got transitions all the way from basic ones to eight part ones going from A to B. We even got transitions coming from B to A. Um, we pretty much got the A, B songs covered. And at this point, you know, I have a list. You have to go to the website. Just go to the website, download the list of songs that you can play with just A and B because it gets ridiculous how many songs just follow these parts. So we'll close out these parts. In the next section, we'll cover part C and D, which shouldn't take a long time because part C is really simple. It's only actually four chords. We call it the pre-turnaround, and part D is the final turnaround. So parts A and B are the biggest parts because they're the foundations. Uh -huh. I mean, when I say you can play full sounding songs with these two parts, I mean it because Kevin and the drummer is about to demonstrate all the songs you can play in a full sounding uh, demo, I could say, or, or, or solo or with Kevin uh, taking us out of part B. So take it away, Kevin. One, two, three. <laughs>